hello friends in my previous video I have shown how to create an API gateway rest API and this is the rest API I have created in this video I'll give a link in the description and it is appearing in the top right corner right now about this rest API creation using API gateway in this video I will create a custom domain which will hit uh, the lambda uh, eventually in instead of this API uh, like in here so I will create a custom domain and to create the custom domain actually I have created um, a root 53 domain registration and this is my domain cloudforfree.co.uk and then I have created hosted Jones this one and also I have created a certificate to certify all the wildcard APIs like um, I've shown in the previous example as well so my API will look like this and for that I have created a certificate and verified it with um, AWS root 53 uh, um, hosted zone and all this video will be appearing in the description and as well as uh, in the top right corner as we speak now now in this uh, video I'm going to create a, a custom domain here let's say if the domain name is like um, calculation data let's say cloud for free dot co dot uk keeping all the settings as default so i will be creating it in a, uh, in a regional endpoint and then I will select the wildcard for the certificate and then create domain name yeah if you see successfully it has created now I need to map it with my API so this is the API it is coming down I have only one API that's why in the drop down I'm able to see only one API I'll select the stage I'm not putting any path here and save it and then I'll try to access this from postman so my custom domain is created here if you see here so I should be able to hit this URL and I will see what is the problem with this one or is it really hitting the URL correctly yep. so operation add no it's not hitting so the problem is even though we have created a mapping yeah we need to create a record in this hosted zone for that one so let me create a record let me say this one so it's going to be this and then it will be an alias of api endpoint if i select the region it should appear my yeah this is the API it is in Ireland region it's a simple uh, routing and then if I do create record that record is created now uh, within 60 seconds it will propagate so that means whenever we have added this record it's not that it is immediately available 
let us give it some seconds and try it yeah it's not available yet we'll keep this keep trying this one in the browser yeah it is appearing now yeah sometimes it takes time to appear in the postman yeah it's get if i hit it yeah it's taking some time to refresh it here but in the browser we can see it is giving me the result so now let's say if I do multiply yeah so this function is not defined because the spelling was wrong now it is giving the multiplication result if I just do divide it will give me the division value now this uh, API creation, this REST API, uh, I mean, API Gateway REST API creation, I have created a video for that one, which is hitting a lambda for the detail uh, of that. You can check that video, but this is, this is how we create a custom domain to hit a REST API. Now in my upcoming video, I will query Athena data uh, using REST API and the Lambda. And I will get the result um, in a query, uh, uh, in a output body, in a JSON format. And then I will show you what's the drawback of using API gateway and how can we get rid of that drawback and what all other options we can use from uh, aws for that so keep watching uh, this youtube channel for that i'll be coming up with that video in a couple of days and uh, please subscribe my channel for supporting me and uh, please like share and comment in this video as well if you like it or don't like it or if you, if you want something else to discuss in this channel i can discuss if you make some comments in my videos thank you if you see now it's it's appearing here in uh, postman and if you try with other operations it is appearing now so it takes um, some time to propagate uh, the changes uh, in postman now it is appearing so we can query from the browser and the postman as well